All right, what is going on, Z Nation? And today I'm here, guys, into going to Devo, my Crowed Skull Knight. That's right. So I have um, him maxed out right now, 200. I am going to bump his skill to 9 to 10. Um, I also have my Life Drain Skull Knight as well. Already at a 9 to 10, 8 of 8 Life Drain. Um, but I'm going to go with the Guild Wars Skull Knight right here. So we're going to go ahead and Devo this bad boy. Um, I got the five evolution runes, got the crystals, and we have three Skull Knight cards. So let's go ahead and Devo him. And we're going to get all those books back. There it is, man. Good stuff. Bam, all those books right back. So let's go in here and level him up real quick. <clears throat> all right, here we go. <coughs> Can't wait to see this bad boy in action, man. His HP will be able to compare it to the other, um, Skull Knight. I'm gonna try to bump him up to at least 180. Save a few of those books in case if I need... Some, uh... Alright, we need 5 million gold, so we need, like, uh, 2.5 million in gold, so let's go do it. And today is the first day of Castle Crisis, but, uh, luckily, uh, I want to say thanks to IGG for, man, for, uh, lowering that... There we go. Lowering that gold and mana drop down to, uh, 2 million instead of, um... 10 million, such a huge help. Man, you got that grizzly, uh, beast hammer and grizzly runner. Oh, I didn't mean to drop that. Well, there we go. I used the flag to get that gold back. Alright, here. One more raid and we should be good. One more million raid, possibly. There we go. Yeah, there's there. Drop the flag, get our money back. Aries is up the other end. And I'm kind of testing out some heroes on, um, I seem to be getting Flame Guard here recently. So I put, um, did that Druid really just kill my Beast Tamer? Well, Grizzly's still alive. There we go. I'm not really worried about Beast Tamer, but. Yeah, I'm kind of um, testing out this theory about Flame Guard on Destroyer because I don't really have a talent for him. So, I'm testing that out. I'm going to see how it works out. Alright, here we go. Bam! HP is 205. So, let's compare it. So, all that bumped up. He's about 255 HP with the level 3 life drain. And I got him in Goblet. But when I use him for Guild Wars, I put him in a uh, Blitz Scroll so he does not get stunned by those magic towers. Alright, so 255,000. Let's compare him to this Skull Knight. Now, this one I have a Deadly Strike Crest set 4 because his main talent is a Life Drain 8. And also, if I use any Skull Knight in Guild Wars, I put him in Blitz Scroll for sure. Um, and now, if it's. Um, Arrow Towers, I will put them in Goblet or Victor's Emblem to reduce the damage. That does make a huge difference. But, with this here, yeah, he has about... Well, that does give him a lot more uh, health and stuff with that level 4 crest set. But yeah, he has about another 70-some uh, thousand HP, which should hold him up very well. So there it is, guys. That gives me my 1, 2, three. Let me count these right. I messed up yesterday. That makes my ninth Devo. Alright guys, yeah, and like I was saying, we are going to be getting close, which I'm going to get my uh, Ghoulam to 200. And then I'm going to Devo him, because right there I have three Ghoulam cards, so he is on his way to um, level 200, which right there is at 196. 
roughly about halfway there. And for that video, I'm going to take his uh, War God to 8 of 8. I got all the evolution runes. I'm just going to make it, uh, make us wait till we get him there. And this Skull Knight is pretty much good to go. Other much, other much than just getting him to 9 of 10. But, uh, I think, I mean, really between 8 and 10 and 9 and 10 really isn't much of a difference. Um, let's just compare them real quick. By 700%. And it's 750, so it's 50 more percent. And he takes 4,000 on a 9 of 10. And he takes 5,000 on an 8 of 10. So really, it's not that much of a difference. It's 50% more damage and 1,000 per hit. I don't think that's really going to make any kind of difference. I mean... Let me just go back here and compare that real quick. I really don't think it's going to... If it's really worth to bump that one up. So yeah, 8 of 10 has a 700 attack damage. 5,000 per 10 seconds. And it has a level 8 revive. Cooldown 12. Cooldown still the same. So yeah, I mean the only difference is 50% more damage and 1,000 less per hit. So it's really not that much of a difference. I may save my shards to um, possibly either 10 of 10 this uh, Skullnate, which, I mean, uh, Ares, which could be very useful, actually. So get that extra half a second on the silence. So put your comments down below, guys. What do you think I should do? Maybe save up to um, get my first 10 of 10 Guild War Sniper. I think my only 10 of 10 hero is the Pumpkin Duke. And everyone else, I got pretty much nine. Um, but I think Ares is a good one because he does get an extra, I think, half a second for silence. So, all right, guys, I'm going to get up out of here. If you have any accounts you'd like me to roll on, please contact me on line chat at TerryZ24. Or you can contact me on kick at TerryZ24 Gaming. So, all right, guys, I'll catch you on the next video. Peace. Damn phones, Babylon can't